Hey my pro friends, welcome back. I just want to say that um, during my time that I had my yarn braids, I didn't want to make any videos because I wanted to be able to show you the things that I do with my hair. This video is going to be about um, the products that I like using. So I'm going to quickly kind of go through the products that I use and let you know how I use them, kind of where I got them, and maybe like the price range. So I'll start off. This is Giovanni's. Uh, direct leave-in weightless moisture conditioner so it's a leave-in conditioner I use this I did show it on my moisture 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 video and so I use this on my hair after a wash and it makes my hair really curly it gives it a good moisturizing and um, it also helps a lot with detangling so I love this stuff you can get it at Ulta you can get it at um, Whole Foods or you can buy it online they do have a website it's like Giovanni's.com something like that Next I have my Shea Moisture's Curl Enhancing Smoothie. This is one of the things that I like to use a lot. Um, I use it as a, um, a, style, a curling styler, as you can see. Um, I use it for my twist outs, my braid outs. I use it for a lot of different reasons. So this is one of the things that I like to use so that I can keep my hair moisturizer, moisturized. It's very good. Um, a little goes a long way and I just really love this stuff, like I said. Um, you can buy it, Rite Aid, Walgreens, Target, probably Walmart now. So if you go to a couple different places, I'm pretty sure you can find it. It's about $10 to $15 depending on where you buy it from. My next product is castor oil. I love this stuff. I'll probably say that about all my products. Anyways, um, castor oil I use as a sealer. And um, in my moisture moisture video, um, this was the last thing that I used on my hair to seal in all the moisture. It's heavy and um, it is thick so you don't need to use a lot of it but it does help to keep your hair moisturized for a while. I bought this at Whole Foods for about nine dollars and it's lasting me for about six months or so. So this stuff's really good and um, as I said it does help to keep my hair moisturized for a while. Next I have coconut oil. Coconut oil, I got this from Sprouts, but you can buy it from a couple different places. It was about $10. Um, it is 16 ounces and it's lasted me uh, probably from about June till now. I'm almost out of it as you can see. Um, uh, you can use it to cook, but also obviously I use it in my hair. Um, it does come in a solid form, so when you do buy it, you have to put it in hot water so that you can um, liquefy it so that you can put in your hair. I use this for my moisturizing. I put it in my spritzers and I use it um, a lot for my pre-poos and different things like that. And if, you, if you're not sure about what I'm saying, I will explain in other videos about those things. Next, I have Eco Styler. I'm not really big on gel, but I do like this when I need something to slick my hair back or if I want my hair to stay real good. I will use this so that I can um, have a really good hold. You want to be careful not to use too much and be careful also because sometimes it doesn't mix well with other products. So I would say use this at your own risk type thing and um, you are you know susceptible to you know get flakes if you use too much or if you don't wash it out. So just be real careful and just kind of learn with your hair how it works. But I do love this stuff. It does have a great hold and um, it's something that I don't use often but when I use it it works well for me. Next, I have, um, and please forgive me because I'm probably saying the name wrong, but Talia Wajid. Um, this is Curly Curl Cream and Curl Sealer. I actually just bought this from um, a friend, and I tried them out on my hair, and actually I think it did really well with the twist out. Um, this one's more of cream, and this one looks kind of like a gel. Um, you could use it if you like it. Um, I really do like it. I think it made my hair, my hair really defined. So, um, but you know, you can always choose what kind of styler you want to use, but I actually kind of did like these and I think I will continue to use them. As far as shampoos and conditioners go, um, I use a few shampoos and conditioners. One is Tresemme Naturals. Um, this is the, the shampoo that has lower sulfates. It's not a no sulfate shampoo, so just remember that. If you like shampoo that's uh, no sulfate, this is not the one for you, but I use it because there are times when I use a lot of hair products and I need to get all of it out. So I use the shampoo in order to do that. Along with the shampoo, I do use the conditioner. I use this 
when I wash, but I also use it as a co-wash, which is just uh, washing your hair with conditioner only. Really good, great slit. It helps with um, detangling while you're in the shower, but it also helps um, to keep the moisture in. So great conditioner, I like it a lot. Um, this stuff I love, I really, really love it, and I said I'd probably say that about most of my products, but this is called um, Herbal Essences Hello Hydration. I only use the conditioner, and like I said, I use this as a co-wash. I probably use this one a lot more often than the, uh, than the other one, but I really do like this one because it has great slip, and it actually smells really good. Um, it's not sulfate-free or, or uh, silicone-free, but I still use it because my hair loves it. So, you know, you can debate on whether or not you like silicones or sulfates, but I use this stuff because my hair loves it. So, I continue to use it and I like it a lot. Lastly, um, this is <laughs> empty almost, but this is VO5 Tea Therapy Conditioner. I use this um, because one, you can get it at the 99 cents store really cheap. And two, because um, sometimes if I'm pre-pooing or if I just need some, like need a quick wash, something that I know I can go through really quickly and then just go to the store and buy a um, um, another one if I run out. So this is the one I use probably most often. It's one of the main reasons why it's empty. But um, I like this one a lot because it's great for when you need a quick wash, when you're, you don't mind like throwing it away after it's done if it goes quickly because you can always go buy another one. Oh, I forgot to tell you how much I spent on this one. Um, this I bought at Walmart. It was about $7, but also kind of just depends on where you buy it. Um, with these, they were about 5 or $6 each, but if you find a good sale, you know, it's really worth it. So, um, these are the products that I use on my hair. Um, I can go more into detail about what, in what ways that I use them, but this is, this is the main, these are the main, my staple products, which, um, obviously a staple would be something that you stick with and you really like. So, these are the products that I like to use. If you have any questions, you can leave a comment in the description uh, and in the comments box and I'll try to leave all the names of everything in the description box under the title. Alright my girlfriends, have a great day.